Hey YouTube, uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys masks. It is a city at tweak and it allows you to change the uh, shape of the icons on your springboard. It's uh, $1.99 on the Big Boss repo and you can go check it out if you'd like. So uh, let's get into the review. So mask, here it is under extensions and you can change uh, the shape of your icons and it gives you a lot of different shapes to choose from. Uh, I have it set to just the standard circle and you guys can see that it's uh, all my apps look like uh, circles instead of the standard square or rectangle looking design. Um, we can change it to let's go with a noticeable one how about this diamond shaped one and you don't have to respring or anything, you can just close out of settings and it changes and it's pretty cool. Uh, I think it's worth the $1.99 and uh, there's some more settings that you can change also. So uh, let's change it to this fading one from left to right and let's also uh, invert it and what inverting it does is it flips it so wherever it normally is dark it's actually that's where it's fading and I'll show you guys so it was fading from left to right there and now it's fading from right to left it just kind of flips the uh, the image or the shape or whatever you guys want to call it so uh, we can also make uh, the shape random we can close out and it randomly uh, selects a shape for all your apps and uh, that's pretty cool but it doesn't look as nice as the one shape. Now uh, you can you can select to have it uh, mask your folders or not. For that, you do have to respring, and you can change the color also. And uh, it doesn't like let you select from colors. You have to like kind of mix and match on this different. Uh, I guess you can call it a scale. And uh, actually, let's change it to something more noticeable. All right, uh, let's go. Let's go really red. I guess that's reddish. Actually, that's not reddish. Alright, there we go. That's a red color. And there we go. Everything's changed to a reddish color, and it looks pretty cool. It definitely uh, allows for a lot of customization. So now also with masks, we can uh, change our wallpaper. And this, this is kind of weird. It doesn't look too nice. So uh, I have it set as the circle one, and if we close out... It, it just looks kind of weird. I don't understand why you would use this, but I mean, if you have a cool background where this might look cool, uh, go for it. And now you can do the same thing with the lock screen. There's not much to show there. And that's really the whole app. Uh, thanks for watching. If you guys want to pick this up, again, it's $1.99 on the Big Boss repo, and it's, it's pretty cool. It uh, allows for a lot of customization. And uh, something I've noticed that it really helps out with is... Uh, for some winterboard themes where like uh, glass orb, I'm sure some of you have seen that theme, it changes all your icons into little like glass orb looking uh, balls. Uh, it doesn't change it for the recent iOS 5 uh, icons like messages and reminders and uh, the uh, newsstand app, but with this you can change that so they're set as circles so it still looks like it blends in and just makes it look better than it normally does. Thanks for watching, uh, $1.99 on the Big Boss repo, and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more City of Tweaks for iPad and iPhone and all that, uh, you can subscribe to me, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Thanks for watching, and have a nice day.